Hey you guys, it's Peter and welcome to my channel. Peter! That's me. Boom, 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 <laughs> Review stuff. And I am sitting out by the pool in Florida. Um, it is one of our, here's the pool. And there's me. My husband's sitting right there. He's playing his game. Um, he's real into that game township. He plays it all the time. But anyway, um, I am actually pre-filming this video because if, if everything goes right, I will be posting this video on Monday, um, which is after we get back. But I wanted to do this video down here because I have received <laughs> so many suggestions for me to do this video. So let me tell you how it all started. Um, I mentioned the other day that we went to Publix grocery store while we were down here. I actually mentioned that I thought that Publix grocery store was very expensive compared to Indianapolis because when we go to Indianapolis or the grocery stores in Indianapolis, I feel like most of the things that I get are about half the price that they were at Publix. And I don't know if that's just being in Florida. I don't know what that's about, but like cheese, in Indianapolis for like, uh, I don't know, these like bars of pepper jack cheese are like $2.59. Down here, they're like $5.59. Macaroni salad was like twice as much. So it seemed like everything was a dollar to two dollars more down here than it was in Indianapolis. I don't know if that's Publix. A lot of people commented and said that, this was on my vlog, a lot of people commented and said that Publix was really, really expensive. So I don't know if that's true or not. But people also recommended that I go there and I try their sub sandwiches. They said they have like the best sub sandwiches in the entire world and that I try the key lime pie. Then I started getting messages from people saying, but if they have the mango key lime pie, you must get the mango key lime pie. So we were coming uh, back to the house today and I asked Alex to stop at Publix. So we went in there and I got a sub, which I will tell you about in just a second. And then they didn't, they had a key lime pie and then they also, they didn't just have a key lime pie. They had the mini mango key lime pie. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Okay, so hold on a second. Let me get my thumbnail, you ready? Okay, so I'm gonna try this sub, a little bit of it. We actually just ate probably about two hours ago. I'm gonna have a little bit of that. I'm gonna have a little bit of this um, pie, but I wanna try this while this stuff is fresh. Um, Alex doesn't want any of this key lime pie. Are you not a key lime pie fan, <laughs> sir? He said no, he's shaking his head no. Okay. No ma'am, he said so. <laughs> I don't see any ma'ams around here, unless you're talking about me, then boom, 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 boom. Okay, so we're gonna get into the pie in just a second, but first we're gonna try, um, this Subway sandwich. Now, I have to tell you, this was kind of an ordeal. So, um, there were two people ahead of me and there were two people that were working on the subs, these two women, and it, it takes an average of about 10 minutes a sub to get made, okay? Um, now, they have all different kinds of subs. All the meat that they use is boar's head meat, which I don't, you know, eat sandwich meat anymore because I'm a vegetarian. But when I did eat sandwich meat, I loved boar's head, boar head, boar's head meat and I loved boar's head cheese, and I still do, um, that you can get in the deli of most grocery stores. So that's some meat that they use there. They had several different kinds of bread. I just got white bread, and then I got, they had two, they had a vegan sandwich that was called, ooh, I don't remember what it was called. But I got the veg, maybe it was called the greeny or something like that. I got the vegetarian one that was the Greek. And it has hummus, feta cheese on it, um, what else? Uh, mayonnaise, mustard, avocado, and then as many veggies as you want. And I got onion, uh, green, uh, blah, 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 banana peppers, lettuce. What else did I get? Black olives. I think that's it. So anyway, that's what I got. I got the, um, and she cut it in half. So they did a very nice, nice job of making these. It was just a long process. Alex was standing there the whole time. So anyway, he was very, very patient. This is what the sub looks like. Here, I should probably do my thumbnail like this. A little mango tart for you. Okay, now I have heard so much about these subs. If these subs are not beyond, hold on, I should probably open my water first. If these subs are not beyond, I'm gonna be like completely let down. I do like a good sub. And I really like that they had vegetarian options too. I mean, you can make your own, but she was like, do you want the hummus? I was like, uh, duh. <laughs> That's what makes the, makes the Greek, right? She was like, do you want the feta cheese? Duh. <laughs> I want all of it. Okay, let's try it. Mmm. I got a full size one. I didn't know if I'd be hungry later. But um, this is how much I have. It's big size. Family friendly. Okay. Mm, it's really good. I told Alex it was like a Greek salad as a sandwich. It's actually better than that. Mm. 
Yeah. Much better than Subway. The bread is like a hard baguette. I would definitely get these a lot if I was down here. I mean, it's like real feta cheese. They actually, while I was there, they ran out of avocado and they ran out of feta cheese. And the other woman literally just walked around to where like the cheese section was and she just got a carton of like the best feta cheese. And then she had an avocado too. Mmm. That was really good. I honestly can't think of anything that I wouldn't want in it. The hummus with the feta cheese is really good. I thought it would be like kind of really soggy, but it's not. I don't want to eat all of this because I want to save it as a snack for later, but I could. I mean, it's that good. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna give that a five out of five. This is absolutely delicious. Oh, I didn't tell you how much this was. This was $5.89 for a foot long. Uh, Publix vegetable cheese sub whole. Which is cheaper than Subway sandwiches, isn't it? Do you know how much a sub is? Babe, do you know how much a sub is? No. You, don't, no. you don't go there, do you? Yeah, five out of five. And I think the price is fantastic. After thinking that everything else are expensive, you know? I also thought that this little pie, it's $4.99 for this little mini pie. I mean, it's really pretty big, don't you think? I mean, you could get four good slices out of that with like some coffee, you know, if you had a little dinner party. It has a big piece of melon right on the top. We're gonna eat that. <laughs> I mean, why wouldn't you? Okay. The crust is very interesting. I don't really know how to explain what the crust is, but it's like whipped cream with like all these little nuts in it. Do you see that? I like nuts. Family, fr nuts and cream, family friendly. <laughs> oh my God, that kind of tastes like a hot fudge sundae a little bit because of the nuts, you know? Okay. I would put this on a plate, but he's not gonna eat any of it, so it doesn't matter. Here's what it looks like. Oh my God. That is so good. You want a bite of it? You sure? Positive. Oh my God, it's so good. You can really taste like the mango with the key lime pie. Like I love a good key lime pie. It's one of my favorites. But like you can really taste some mango in here. Oh, this is straight five out of five. It kind of reminds me of something other than key lime pie though. This is what it looks like. What does it remind me of? I don't know, but it's really good. And if like key lime pie is too tart for you, this is actually not too tart. It's like just perfect. I think the, the mango really complements it. Yeah. This is a five out of five. That is a five out of five. My avocado is escaping from the sandwich as we speak, so I better eat that. <laughs> this was a really great experience. Everything is a five out of five. I was, honestly, I was kind of expecting not to like it, but I'm super impressed with all this. So here's the sandwich, five out of five. Here's the pie, five out of five. If you live anywhere where there's a Publix, I definitely recommend going to try this. So, anyway, I love you guys, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.